Hey, hello and welcome all my dear third standard little gems. How have you been? I hope my all the dear girls and boys are good, are fit and fine and have watched my previous recent lecture of science. My dear little gems, I hope that many of your doubts are clear from the first sent lecture and also from the previous online live lectures. I am trying my level best to interact with you in the lectures. My dear little gems, please make sure whenever I send you this lecture, you have to sit with your books or if possible, whatever answers you had written, please sit with that so that you will be able to check your answers. Those who have tried to solve the questions on their own, especially to them, it will be beneficial if they check their answers from these lectures. Even those who are not able to answer 50% of the paper, for them it is the golden opportunity to solve the paper with me here online. So welcome once again in the science lecture dear students. I hope that today you are sitting with your books as informed to you in the previous lectures that always in the science lecture you have to sit with your rough notebooks so that whatever necessary changes or unsolved question answers if you want you can note it down on the spot within the given time period. Not only that but also few questions are very well explained the questions which I think should be explained for your base to build up I am explaining it in the lecture. Please try not to miss out any of the topics Try to write down the answers still if even you have written it previously so that later you can match your answers. And as you know that the assignment questions were of third standard. So obviously if you will revise it, if you will write it two or three times, it will be beneficial to you. So be ready with your books. What are we going to do today? We will do the same thing. We together will solve the assignment of bridge course from the left out question. From where we have paused, we will resume. We will continue our lecture from there. Obviously, whatever we have done in the previous lecture, I will just give you the glimpse of that. But before that, I want you to take out your books and be ready before we start. I will give you a couple of seconds to be ready. Okay, my dear students, I hope that you are ready with your rough books. Please give the heading bridge course assignment below that subject science. If you want to continue from the previous work you have done in your rough book, you can do it if you have the space on the very next page of where we have stopped. So, please write today's date on the new page. Never miss out to write the date. I hope that the parents, the guardian and the brothers and sisters are helping you in your work when you are watching the science lecture. And I am trying my level best to repeat the instructions to go slowly so that you will be able to cop up, you will be able to finish all the work asked to be written or to be read in the lecture. So my dear students, now I hope that you are totally ready. Then you also must be knowing that where have we stopped in the previous lecture, won't you? So we, we were solving bridge course assignments on the back side. 
if you remember you had the PDF and I asked you to solve or to check your answers from the back side that means the last question we are solving first so we are going anti-clockwise so we solved this question question and answers I explained you each question and then I wrote the answer wherever I thought that your words may be different I even told you what kind of answers you could have written so I hope that you have no doubt in that and moreover after solving it no queries were there in my whatsapp so I am very sure that my students are very very clear about whatever questions were asked then we solved this question give two examples for the following and then here you know that give two example does not mean that whatever I write is the only answer here again the answers may vary from student to student but I gave you the idea what kind of answer it could be the easiest way I gave you and again after this lecture was given no queries were there from the students side so I hope that these two things are very clear now students we are going to solve this you have to label the diagram and before that you have to unjumble the words it is already jumbled you have to properly form the word right in the blank after all the words are properly formed you have to see that which word will be labeled in the which part of the plant isn't this very easy yes it certainly is now before we try to solve this I want you all to write down this heading please note down this heading unjumble the names of different parts of the plant then label them correctly in the picture given below so I will give you a couple of seconds to write the heading please write it down I hope my dear students all the instructions given in the lecture is very clear and you are working on the instructions given accordingly okay be little bit fast as even in the previous lecture I asked you to be faster than you were in the previous year you need to upgrade yourselves okay now I will request you to write down question 1, 3 and 5 it is my request to all the students to write down question 1, 3 and 5 there is no reason for asking you to write down the question in this sequence it's just that it is in the line so just write down question if even you give it the label 1, 2 and 3 that's alright it is just that we have to solve all these 6 jumble words and we have to label the diagram that's it so please write down these 3 highlighted questions in the box I will again wait for the couple of seconds see maximum role is yours you have to try to finish writing try to find out the answer and try to verify the answer in the time limit so please write down these three questions and keep the space as it is kept after the word I hope that you have almost started writing question 5.
so it is c o r o f a l e d u b seems very interesting and it seems like it is very easy to unjumble the letters and form the correct word if you have the knowledge of the part of the plant this is very easy okay by now i hope you people are ready with these three questions let's first make the proper word now t o r o what does it mean toro no there is no part of the plant called toro so what it could be can you say t o r o r tour no can you say r o o t root oh yes root is the part of the plant so let's write the answer it is r o o t root see isn't it very easy again f a l e uh it sounds like false no but there is no part of the plant called fail or fail or fall whatever you pronounce it but let's unjumble it can you say l e f a um uh, no can you say l e a f yes or no l e a f what word it forms leaf correct l e a f is leaf again d u b this is already solved you have to just read it from the back side it's b u d bud b u d bud okay check your answer if you have solved if not please write down the answer and till then please write these three questions on the right hand side now Two, four, and six. I will wait for you to write down the question, and it is needless to say that you have to leave one line after writing each question. It will be very neat and clean work when you will send it to your follow-up teachers. So. I hope that you have started writing the question. Questions. There are three questions on the right hand side: two, four, and six. All right. Now it seems like you could have finished writing by now. So number two, M E S T. Number four, L O W E R F. And number six, R U T I F. Again, these all are very easy compared to the left hand side. Yes, I mean it. So, are you ready? Let us solve two, four, and six. M E S T. There is no part of the plant called mast. Um, can you say T E S M? No. Then can you say S T E M? Oh yes. Let us write the answer. See, stem. It is a part of the plant, isn't it so? I know that you all are very clever. You all might have the answers with you, but I also hope at the same time that those answers which you have are solved by yourselves using your own mind. Okay, next one. Oh, it is very easy. 
isn't it this is the most important thing which makes the tree beautiful smells nice what is it flower so it's f l o w e r you need to just shift the last letter in the beginning flower okay and the last one what's the thing again this is very easy even though it is jumbled it sounds somewhat like original thing r u t i f no what word could be made let me write the answer it is very 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 easy f r u i t look we solved all these six questions now there is one thing which is left what is it we need to label these words at the proper places where they have kept the arrow let's do it then let's go this way in the sequence what is this part of the plant can you say students the part which is now highlighted yes so what is this part when the flower is just opening and this half grown part what is it called it is b u d bud let us label it properly bud great stuff see it's very easy let's go down oh what is this easily we can recognize this part correct what is it it is a flower so let's type the answer flower tell me which part is this then if it is a flower this greenish part with the help of which plants make their food which is this part it's very easy it is a leaf correct it is a leaf wow now the next oh something is hanging here what is it what do you think is it a flower no flower is light in the weight lighter in the weight compared to what is hanging here so what is this obviously it's very easy to recognize it is a fruit oh slowly we are getting the answer for all this now this one with the help of which plants can stand still erect upright yes this transfers the water to the every part of the plant from the root so which is this part i gave you the answer right now when i was explaining you that this part passes the water taking from the root so obviously these are the root and this is the stem let's write the answer stem and what is the last part root so it's r o o t wow we have labeled the diagram we have unjumbled the word so this question is over wasn't it very easy and fun to solve yes i did not say that all the students should have the knowledge of every single word but it was still very fun to solve it isn't it so okay then with this we have solved main three questions let's move towards the next one so now if we reach here the question is match the following please give the heading match the following this is the last question of today's lecture match the following please give the heading
again this is very easy these column a and b two columns are related to the body parts the previous question was of the part of the plant this is the part of the human body which we have to match with their functions now i hope that you have written the heading match the following i will request all the students to write column a yes just column a that is number 1 2 3 and 4 and 5 don't write a b c d e don't write column b just write column a i will wait for the couple of seconds column a i hope that you have started writing the question number 1 tissue number 2 muscle number 3 stomach number 4 lungs and number 5 heart so these five words you have to write and directly when i give you the answer you have to just write a b c d or e don't try to write full line answer now if at all you have solved you can directly check your answer no need to even write it down but this is for those who did not solve match the following they have to write column a and directly they have to write a b c d or e this letter you have to write instead of writing full sentence later you can write full sentence it is up to you okay then i suppose you should have finished writing column a but still i'll give you a couple of seconds don't worry don't panic please complete writing number 1 2 3 4 and 5 i hope my dear students you are writing the questions on the column a side okay then now it's the time to discuss and solve it let's get started tissue can you say it pumps the blood no mixes the food thoroughly that's not the work of tissue is it a respiratory organ no it is not helps the body to move um no not actually there obviously the last option is remaining it is made up of many cells tissue is the combination of many cells moving on muscle but students please make sure when i am joining the columns that means you have to check your answer or if you have not written the answer you have to just write the letter say for an example tissue the answer is made up of many cells you don't have to write this full line you have to just write letter e beside the word tissue then later on you can again go through the pdf file and write full answer okay then muscle is it does it work to pump the blood no mixes the food thoroughly um no respiratory organ no helps the body to move yes muscle helps the body to move so you have to write letter d as the answer and those who have written please check your answer I hope you are working it out. Then comes stomach. Oh, you in the lockdown 
all the students were having the stomach full all the time eating and sleeping right so what is the work of stomach stomach pumps the blood um not actually it mixes the food thoroughly it can be let's check the remaining option first respiratory organ no obviously then the answer is mixes food thoroughly see i am using different colored lines so that you will be able to recognize the answers properly here number 3 stomach answer is letter b you have to just write b and then later on you can again refer to the letter b and write full sentence the last two question and last two options lungs what is the work of lungs pumps the blood or respiratory organ yes many were getting confused is heart pumping the blood or lung anyways lungs it is the respiratory organ and heart pumps the blood so i have matched the answer i'll give you a couple of seconds to check your answers i'll be silent for few seconds check your answers now i hope that you have corrected your incorrect answer you have checked your answer so this is the end of our today's lecture in the next lecture we will finish solving all the remaining questions that is true or false fb and mcq have a nice day stay safe goodbye